FIFA is unarguably the most innovative and unorthodox football game franchise of all time, apart from jumpers for goalposts respectively. From the intensity and engaging competitive gameplay of foot champions the suspenseful adrenaline rush of opening that 100,000 coin pack only to find out you get absolutely nothing. Go! Falcao! Falcao! Nevertheless, FIFA is a game loved by millions and although these features can occasionally be an inconvenience, <laughs> we will always keep coming back for more. As you can imagine, in a game so addictive and world-renowned, there will always be questions, there will always be conspiracies. Therefore, in this series pilot episode, I have brewed together a concoction of these theories about FIFA 18 and will be either confirming or busting them. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you FIFA Mix. Well, that was slightly too dramatic. Guys, welcome to the first edition of FIFA 18 Myth, the series where we go through some popular questions slash conspiracies about FIFA 18 and we will be putting them to the test and either confirming or denying whether they are true. But you guys don't want to hear all this, so without further ado, let's get into the first myth. Believe it or not guys, this first myth is actually true and the way you can trigger this celebration is by scoring a goal, obviously, then holding LT and then pressing up on your right stick and then as you can see on screen your players will proceed to do the mannequin challenge but nevertheless it is a cool addition, they've also updated the dab celebration so now when you trigger the dab celebration your teammates actually come beside you and start dabbing as well so that's pretty cool. So unfortunately I'm going to have to confirm with you guys that this myth is busted. However, there is a more plausible answer as opposed to the kid being Alex Hunter's son. There is a big possibility that he could be maybe a long lost brother or something. He is obviously relevant to the storyline as as you can see on the screen he keeps Alex popping Hunter. up throughout the journey and it would just be so cool if it turns out maybe at the end of the journey Alex Hunter returns you'd um you'd find out that Alex Hunter is his brother and there'd be some sort of reunion. I feel like that would be really cool. But guys, if the kid was Alex Hunter's son, the kid does look about 10, so it would mean Alex Hunter would have had to impregnate a girl at the age of 8, and the girl would have had to give him birth at him at the age of 9. So, probably, probably not. Anyway guys, next myth. <laughs> The last myth of the day, guys, believe it or not, is actually a confirmed one. EA have actually taken out the usual 180 turn fake shot, where you'd like fake shot back on yourself and sort of turn back with a fake shot. They've actually replaced it now, guys, with the Cruyff turn, which pretty much is the exact same thing, but it just looks a lot cooler and he hits it with a different part of the foot. And it does actually look a lot cooler than a fake shot. And there's a really cool skill move combo where you can actually like use it once and then use it back on yourself and the defenders just flop. It's amazing, guys. But anyway, guys, that is going to conclude the myth for today. Thank you guys for watching this if we could smash 10 likes that'd be crazy we're almost at 300 subs if we could hit that before fifa 18 probably not going to happen but if we could that'd be amazing but comment below if you guys do want more fifa myths i'm probably going to do five in a usual episode but as i had the intro and everything to fifa myths i decided to only do three on this video plus i don't want to drag the videos out too long you know because i want to keep you guys entertained you don't want to keep watching the same thing over and over again so yeah comment below if you do want more fifa myths and thank you guys for watching i'll see you in the next one